Hey, how you doing? It's Buddy from Capistrano Volkswagen. Send you a video on the car. Uh, they were talking about this car because it came to us with no sunroof, so it looks like it has a credit of $1,200 uh, on the manufacturer sticker. So I could send that to your email so you can get a better look. Uh, but this one's the R line, the 2022, gray with the black, 19 inch wheels. Uh, let me see if you could see the credit. Um, if that does not focus, I'm able to send that to your email so you can see. But it's a $1,200 credit for not having a sunroof on the car. Uh, and also, there was actually a little bit of damage to this door uh, when my guy was inspecting it. I'm not sure if you're able to see that, but it's like a little bleach white stain or something like that that's on there. I'm not sure what it is, so we're going to send the door out to get professionally done. Uh, so it's going to pretty much look like factory. Uh, it doesn't happen often, but sometimes they come from uh, shipping a little bit damaged, uh, and then it's up to the dealership to just to kind of get it back back to 100% uh, brand new. So uh, this is one of the cars that we have to send out, unfortunately. Uh, no sunroof on the car, but everything else in the car looks perfect. Uh, that's what was marked down. I'll do a quick little walk around so you can actually get a better look at the vehicle. They uh, painted the tailpipes instead of chrome black on the bottom, which I have a 2020. I wish they would have did that a long time ago. Uh, they also moved the Tiguan underneath the new Volkswagen symbol on the back of the car. The lights kind of look the same. 19-inch wheels instead of 20s. The new badge on the side. And I had the key, so we'll jump inside as well. Black uh, side markers or the side mirrors. That's how the uh, last year was as well. The new IQ uh, headlights. That's one of the biggest ones. And also the parking sensors down there. Are those parking sensors or is that a new safety features? Let me check it out. Uh, one upgrade, um, it is the, it does have a remote start. Uh, last year did not have remote start. It has remote start now. Uh, nice R line in there, eight way power seat, uh, lumbar support, racing pedals down there, love that part. New steering wheel, new steering wheel, new digital dash. So much sportier steering wheel than mine. Now I'm super jealous. Uh, Volkswagen symbol, the new one. Rito kind of looks the same. Uh, air gauges are all different. Those look nicer. Let me turn this on for you. Uh, looks like a new shift knob as well. Oh yeah, the air gauges are sweet. That's pretty cool. All right, so they all get the digital dash now. Aha, that's the one I like. Uh, you get the big digital speed in the middle, and the cool thing is that when you're on the steering wheel, you can actually select uh, what the right side and the left side look like. So you could actually customize the dash. Uh, I think my wife has the navigation here, so the arrows and everything are on that side, the digital speed, and I think she has gas on this side, kind of like it's set up. Automatic lights on the car, uh, wallet holder down there. Um, they put the stitching on the sides of the doors. They also put the lines in the middle of the seat. Looks nice. Love the R line because it's a black roof line, so this one doesn't have any sunroof, so that kind of keeps it uh, closer to that price range. You got lights in the back. There should still be a third row inside the car. Carnet. Uh, let's check out the radio. Radio looks the same. Uh, satellite radio, three months for free. Electronic parking brake. You do get the auto start stop and also the uh, parking sensor button right here. Hit that, it goes full. I love that. All right, nice mirror. What else? I like that stitching they put in the seats. USB-C's. Just gonna have to figure that out. That is weird. It's just like something light over the door. I'm not sure if you can see it on camera. It just looks like a little white splotch or something. Not that I was rubbed with something wrong, I was like painted the wrong color or something. It's very weird. Oh, shut up. It's a power rear gate. All right, so that is an upgrade. I have a manual gate. 
Uh, the only things that got power gates uh, for last year were SDLs and uh, premiums. So uh, your wife does get a power rear gate. That is an upgrade. And the third row is still here. Um, we just haven't put the mats down because uh, they figured out there was something wrong with the car. We're going to have to send it to the body shop to get professionally done. The door, uh, mat kit in the back, spring loads for the second row seats. Oh, man. Better job. They did a better job with these seats. I like the stitching. Man, you get a button on this thing? That's crazy. That's a good upsell for Volkswagen. All right, man. I uh, wanted to send you this video. I'll get it sent to your phone and your email right now. Uh, but no sunroof to the car, but it's a $1,200 uh, credit. It says sunroof not installed to this vehicle, $1,200 back to you. Um, but they do charge the $90 for the first aid kit, $200 for the privacy cover, uh, $310 for the monster mats. All right, man. There's your car. Talk to you soon. Buddy from Capistrano Volkswagen. Have a great day.